Hello everyone, let's start with the basic concept of management. In this module, we'll learn about organizational objectives and management by objectives. Organizational objectives are the goals that a company wants to achieve within a determined period of time. Organizational objectives are short-term and medium-term goals that an organization seeks to accomplish. An organization's objectives will play a large part in developing organizational policies and determining the allocation of organizational resources. Achievement of objectives help an organization reach its overall strategic goals. The features of objectives, they are challenging. This means the challenging goals require innovative and creative organizational members. Next one is attainable. Goals through challenging should be attainable. People work hard to achieve challenging and innovative goals, but goals should be within their skills and abilities. The next one is time ability. The goals must be achieved within a specific time period. Organizational performance should be viewed and assessed at regular intervals so that goals can be achieved within a specific period of time. The next one is supportive. Goals at low level should support the high level goals. Short run goals should support the long run goals and goals of different departments should also support each other. The next one is priority. At a point of time, an organization has multiple goals and therefore goals should be arranged in an order of priority. Here we can see the impact of organizational objectives as performance measurement is standardized. Second one is common objectives provide unity of action, vision, and goal among the workforce. The third one is planning and implementation of essential processes that has already set an organizational objective. The fourth one is action plans, policies, program procedures are easier to define based on the company goals. And the last one is employee feel motivated and satisfied when they know their actions are contributing to the success of their organization. Moving on to the next topic, which is management by objectives. The definition of management by objectives is management by objective is a strategic management model that aims to improve the performance of an organization by clearly defining objectives that are agreed to by both management and employees. According to the theory, having a say in goal setting and action planning encourages participation and commitment among employees as well as aligning objectives across the organization. Next, we'll talk about the steps in management by objective process. There are various steps, which are defining the organization goals, defining employee objectives, continuous monitoring performance and progress, performance evaluation, performance feedback, and performance appraisal. And first, which is defining organization goals, setting objectives is not only critical to the success of any company, but it is also serving a variety of other purposes. It needs to include several different types of managers in setting goals. The objectives set by the supervisors are provisionally based on interpretation and evaluation of what company can and should achieve within a specified period of time. Next, we'll talk about employee objectives. When the employees are briefed with the general objectives, plan, and the strategies they need to follow, managers can start working with the subordinates on establishing their personal objectives. This is a one-on-one -on -one discussion where subordinates let the managers know about their targets and which goal they can accomplish within a specified period of time with the required resources. The next point here is continuous monitoring, performance, and progress. Through the management by objective approach is necessary for increasing the effectiveness of managers. It is equally essential for monitoring the performance and progress of each employee in the organization. Performance evaluation. Within the MBO framework, the performance is reviewed, which is achieved by the participation of managers concerned. Providing feedback. In the management by objectives approach, the most essential step is the continuous feedback on the results and objectives as it enables the employees to track and make corrections to their actions. Next one is performance appraisal. Performance reviews are a routine review of the success of employees within the MBO organization. The next thing we'll talk about is the benefits of management by objectives. 
Management by objectives help employees appreciate their on-the-job roles and responsibilities. The key result areas planned are specific to each employee depending on their interest, education, qualification, and specializations. The MBO approach usually results in greater teamwork and communication. It provides the employees with a clear understanding of what is expected of them. The supervisor set goals for every member of the team and every employee is provided with a list of unique tasks. Thank you.